Now, the students are often uh, confused by these related terms resistance, conductance, resistivity, conductivity, ohm and Siemens. Okay, so these let us just clarify all of these terms one, once and for all so that we are never confused. Now, we know that Ohm's law says that the ratio of V and I is constant for metallic conductors and that is equal to V by I is equal to R. This R is known as resistance, resistance R. Okay. So that is the first thing that we will uh, note today that resistance R is given by this formula. Now if I invert this equation okay, and then I come up with this formula known as I by V, I am just inverting it, I am just doing the reciprocal on both the sides. This C is known as conductance, Okay, so that is the first thing. Resistance R is given in units of ohm. Conductance C is given in units of Siemens. Yes, okay. Sometimes it is also known as Mohm. So that is an arcane unit, old unit Mohm. Okay. Uh, so this Siemens or the old unit was Mohm. Okay. Both of those are correct but now we use only Siemens and you can use either Siemens S or Mohm. Okay. Uh, but uh, SI unit is Siemens. So nowadays we only use the unit Siemens. Okay. So that is the conductance. So resistance and conductance, these two things are very very clear now. Okay, and Ohm and Siemens also I hope the difference between them is very very clear now. The next thing we de deal with is the resistivity. So resistivity, our R, the resistance is given by the formula rho L by A, where L is the length of the conductor, A is the cross section area and rho here is the resistivity. How does the resistance change? So, uh, resistance is directly proportional to the length as length increases, resistance increases. It is inversely proportional to area as cross section area increases, resistance decreases and the constant of proportionality is actually rho which is the resistivity. So, derivation for resistivity we have already shown, we have already given on this channel. So, definitely look at that. For that we have to go into drift velocity and all of those things but we are not talking about that here today. We are only clarifying what resistivity is. So resistivity is measured in the units of ohm meter okay so that is the units of resistivity not resistance but resistivity rho now the inverse of this resistivity is denoted by symbol sigma and that is known as conductivity and that is given by the units of siemens per meter okay so hopefully we have explained all of these terms numerical based on these terms are available on door step tutor Dot com. So definitely visit our website and practice numericals based on this. They are fully solved and full lectures are also available in case uh, you have doubts. Okay, Thank you very much.